And in Montgomery County tonight, new details about fights that broke out at Gaithersburg High School during a Friday night football game. Yeah, Cheyenne Corin covers Montgomery County for us. She's joining us live in Cheyenne. We hear there's some charges being pressed. What is the school district doing to improve safety at these events? Hi, that's mean. So today, MCPS, they actually held a meeting to discuss that Friday night football brawl. I'm told that meeting included administrators as well as athletic staff. Now, they say the goal of that meeting was to figure out what they could possibly do to prevent this from happening again in the future. But I spoke with some parents who say that they're mainly concerned after hearing that also coaches may have been involved in that fight as well. It definitely worries me as a parent who have children who attend the sporting events and also as a parent who has a player playing in these events. A Montgomery County School District spokesperson says the two teams fighting during a football game Friday night were escorted off the field and dealt with quickly. Following the incident, both principals released a joint statement saying that they are updating their safety plans. And now both schools' football programs also are temporarily suspended as they continue to investigate. I knew once everything settled that, you know, punishment would be doled out. But I don't know that I agree with the blanket suspension of all football programs. Gaithersburg police say another fight happened off the field as crowds were leaving. It involved people not associated with either school. Officials say a school staffer and officer were hurt and another person suffered cuts. Five teenagers are facing assault and other charges for that incident. I think trust has definitely been broken knowing that coaches were involved. Catherine Ford's son plays JV soccer and says on social media, witnesses have said coaches were also involved in the fight on the field, and that's what worries her most. Not only, uh, you know, reinforcing the good sportsmanship among the players, but also the adults, including the coaches. Now, MCPS has not confirmed that coaches were indeed involved in that fight, but I reached out directly to both of those coaches, and I heard back from Northwest coach Travis Hawkins. He wrote in a text message. Let me just read this word for word for what he had to say. He said, at the moment, I'm still shocked at the situation. I am the victim and would like to clear my name soon. Now, I also reached out to the head coach here at Gaithersburg High School. He declined to comment at this time. Now, MCPS says that they are conducting an administrative review of the situation and anyone, student or adult that was involved in this fight will be facing any disciplinary action. We'll make sure that we keep you updated. I'm here in Montgomery County, Maryland. I'm Cheyenne Corrine for DC News Now.